Hey y'all. <clears throat> okay, I wanted to share this um article with y'all. I came across this morning. This is terrible. Uh it says two women from Oklahoma are arrested after a baby's leg was burned so badly it had to be amputated. A baby's grandmother and godmother were arrested after the baby they were meant to be watching was burned so badly that his leg had to be removed. Cordette and Brianna Cole were arrested on child abuse and neglect charges. The women told people that the boy had poured boiling hot water onto himself. And doctors say their story had inconsistencies, but the baby's leg could have been saved had they not waited two weeks before coming to the hospital. What the hell? Okay. A grandmother and godmother were both arrested in Oklahoma. The leg of a baby they were supposed to be watching was so badly burned that his leg had to be removed. Cordette and Brianna Cole were arrested on child abuse and child neglect charges. The 11-month-old baby was taken into OU Children's Hospital for breathing problems, but when doctors examined the child, they discovered the boy had severe burns from above his belly button down to his feet. Furthermore, the pair had waited more than two weeks to take the child to the hospital, by which, the by which time the baby's leg could no longer be saved. Wow. So a grandmother and a godmother. That's crazy. Wow. So it says right here, the grandmother and godmother were looking after the baby because the child's mother was already preoccupied, preoccupied looking after a different child. An affidavit also revealed that the boy had bruises on his head and neck. A tooth had been knocked out and he had a subdural hematoma, bleeding in the brain. Sadly, the burns on the baby's legs were so bad that it had to be amputated. Oklahoma City Police Department investigators learned that the pair were supposed to be looking after the baby while his mother took care of her other sick child. The women explained to police that the baby accidentally put a teapot, pulled a teapot with boiling water on top of himself when he was having a seizure on December 10th. Brianna Cole told the detective they tried to treat the wounds themselves even after his skin was lifting off of him. Two weeks later, on December 25th, she said that the, she brought the baby into the hospital with breathing problems. Police spoke with doctors in an attempt to get a clearer picture of the situation, but more discrepancies appeared to be and couldn't be true. According to the affidavit, when these were pointed out, Brianna Cole kept changing her story. A doctor told investigators that if the baby had received proper medical treatment immediately, he would not have had to have his leg amputated. These women were booked with a $1 million bond each. You know, that's ridiculous. Wow, two weeks to take the baby to the hospital. I mean, you can clearly see he needs attention. What the hell's wrong with people? And then a grandmother. You know, a godmother, okay, whatever, but a grandmother? Yeah, come on now. I don't know. Leave your comments and feedback below. Um, if you have not subscribed to this channel yet, please subscribe. Um... This is Beach Beauty 35. Um, I will be over here on this channel for right now for a while until one of my strikes get lifted. Um, but as of right now, my channel is disabled for uploading. I cannot upload anything to my main channel. So, y'all subscribe. And uh, thank you for the supporters. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, so until next time, I uh, will be. I'll uh, talk to you guys later. Y'all have a great day.